know, there's nothing like a perfectly made omelet. And when you add bacon and avocado, well, now you've really got something. So I pre-cooked some bacon slices and I crumbled them up in a bowl. I also sliced up a fresh avocado. Now I'll squeeze some lime juice over it so it doesn't discolor. I've got some butter melting in a nonstick pan and now I'll whisk together two eggs, add a little bit of cream, that gives it some little bit more body, and then some salt and pepper. And then when the butter foams, you pour the eggs into the omelet pan. And as the eggs set up, just begin pulling back the sides to add volume to your omelet. Now when the omelet is mostly set but still creamy on top, go ahead and add some of that uh, crumbled bacon and a couple of slices of avocado. And then fold the omelet in half. And then we'll add a little cheese on top and let that melt. And let the omelet finish cooking. Okay, the omelet's done and just gently let it slide onto the plate. And now we'll garnish it with some sour cream and some salsa and a little bit more cheese, of course. And a couple of slices of that avocado because that's just delicious. And you can get this recipe by writing to me here at the station or log on to the website and look for the Kitchen Guy link. I'm Chef Jim. Thanks for watching Kitchen Guy, the tastiest two minutes in television. And I'll see you next time.